with the question of 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 young people of black people in their majority uh, not finding something to do with their hands um, we loosely refer to this as unemployment or employment mm -hmm. and the rate is just going up and higher mm -hmm. and um, the economy changes as soon as you get a lot of people into the economy then we are dead mm -hmm. and then say vw has now a plant in Ghana, and then people will then lose jobs, and then oh, General Motors is closing some of the you know their 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 plants or this and that. I want I want to find out what can be a a solution, or what is your critique on the question of employment unemployment um, in South Africa. Um. So we obviously we we be employed within the era you know, like 21st century. We have to appreciate that, that we are in the 21st century now, you know, mm. with 21st, 20, 21st century job market. Yeah, well, um, I don't, and when you look at it that way, and then you look at how 21st century is structured, um, I don't necessarily believe that South Africa has an issue with employment but we have an issue of gullibility. Mm. Yeah, well, it is the fact that it says a car tour, a is running up, that we are now um, unemployed. You know, uh, when we look back at some of the compromises made during the, the discussions and whatnot, you know, whereby and this is a whole now a whole African issue, where you are told you will not engage in manufacturing. You know, and then your presidents, our presidents sign, but we will never manufacture our own cars. We will not produce our own seeds. You know, because IMF is saying, you know what I mean. Then it's 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 not employment. What it's it's what what we are seeking at the more, for me, greater political uh, umbrella is a position to collaborate within our own oppression. And the thing about being a collaborator in your own oppression is that you get extracted for so long and then you lose your juices and then you get thrown out. Mm. Yeah, well, um, let's simplify it into the mines. Yeah, well, mines were a, a, a hub of employment back in the days. But the gold is not permanent. It's not forever. Yapel, retrenchments happen. Mm. On that basis, we are well. Um, when we must live our lives scared that UVW is our tiny plant here, we forget can. You know what I mean? Mm. Then this is not a, 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 an issue of, of employment. Mm. It's an issue of I want to bow to UVW for as long as I can. You know what I mean? Mm. Because with employment, I feel the focus would be skills. If you've got the skills, you can make it yourself. But we don't want the skills engagement. We don't want the skills discussion. We want the puppet master um, arrangement. arrangement. You know what I mean? And then we cry because the master says, I'm going to cut off the strings here. We have all. Um, that's messed up, you know? When you go up the ladder, you know, academia, even our own government, and then you are told that skilled people are being left out. You look at our parliament. Where's the skill in our parliament? You know what I'm, who are you going to say this is a skilled person? Mm -hmm. You know? Um, the ratio, let me not nullify the whole of parliament, but the ratio between skill and willing contributor you know, is, is yeah. our president, for example. You know, when you talk about, he, obviously I'm taking, my, my politics come from observation. Okay. I want to reflect on Riyadh Desai's Mar Marikan. Mm. And let's talk about employment there, Marikan as a, a form of employment, mm. where people die because they are asking for, 
for 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 better conditions to work yeah, well, we can understand them me yeah? um because there's a there's a power dynamic right and then the power dynamic is that kutunyelo abanda bangafana nathi to go and represent abanda kwethu you know to the masters which is what sir ramaphosa did right in that documentary a billionaire right a politician a former unionist you know a, an influential person within government because even at being a gabi yo deputy at that point yeah, but he was still influential very much into the uh, anc hence he was writing emails to government itself says those who look like us ne yeah, when we enter these bee deals we don't have power you know we are just invited into boardrooms and the best we can do is just advocate is that employment is that value for your presence in a in a boardroom you know, you know what i mean mm. so oh, it's the collaboration it's, it's the collaboration yes. you are saying i'm you collaborating know, a bridge, from a disempowered a point you are not there to work you know what i mean and this is where cut work way to has has been you know what i mean it happens a lot with e- e institutions you know a lot of people who are employed are not there employed and it shows within the mediocre standard of of service even am a police you know that we are getting from mm. the service we are getting from our police the service that our people are getting in hospitals you know it's like a performance it's a performance you are there to perform you know what perform. i mean <laughs> you're not there as a person employed to be a policeman mm. or woman mm. you are there to perform that you know and you are there to to uphold the image of the police and getting that incentive yeah well mm. so for me e- 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 unemployment the debate of of unemployment really is 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 uh, we are not getting to the crux of it of the matter of the matter if we are say we are producing jobs to, to what jobs to do what you know jobs to hold up a facade you 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 understand mm. um but of course okay, there are other more immediate pressing issues that no matter if i'm holding up a facade i'm still getting paid and i'm feeding my family the you know mm. what i mean yeah there are those things now those are more personal things you know those are lala nesazela wet or why as a policeman you took a bribe for 5000 to to throw away a docket of a rape you know mm. but ngaba uli police anyani ke ngoxa wenze into enjani and and i guess someone has to care about the well-being you know of society like someone has to step out of the the self mode yes in, into caring about crp you, you know you, what is the condition yeah you know um that the, 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 what is our condition in society mm. let me and ask it, in it, this, it, yeah. it, 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 it's very hard to do that because mm. we are caught in the numbers game mm. that's how employment is 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 is, is done mm. yeah but we, even education you know what i mean um this university enrolled so many students you know yeah but the point is not enrollment the point is to stri- to train them you know what i mean so the fact that we are celebrating enrollments and all these things it, it tells with our media you, you you go there <laughs> you go into these institutions and you do maybe an audit let's play their game let's do the numbers game you know and you say but what what is the skill set here you know what are the people doing what is the remuneration you know what is the general contribution game you know outside of the bubble talk of using these headings you know what i mean yeah man it's it, it's a mess it's a mess and then in your own sense what is the state of men in our society don't learn what um, how would you characterize the experience um of indoor in our society 
there's a whole movement that that um, is busy with the condition of women, mm. and we can applaud that. Mm. Um, I'm I'm wondering if is there anyone thinking about the state of Indoda? You know, people are engaging in bubble talk. I mean, that's that's my land. Um, I think the conditioning of women. If we were to call things by their names, this is may mostly maybe a feminist movement. You yeah. Know? Um, male and female. You know, if I go to the gym and I say I want to have an an arms day, do I do I gym my left hand and say yeah the gym again? You know, man the You know, do I say you know what I mean? Yeah. And the fact that we we think it's okay that. We are developing society by Jima Lengal. You know, we, we, we've already been sold to, to the facade. Mm. You, you know what I mean? And a lot of the time, the lie exposes itself to what is considered revelations of this thing. Mm. You know, that this thing supposedly only exists in comparison to another. You, you know what I mean? Mm. Um, my left foot resist, exists in comparison to my my right, but not in the function of how they get the body from A to B. Together. Together. Yeah, mm. And no matter what, kwa kuki rai rai dala enyi ti pam di pam bilenyi ti ai yabo zai kumbula ndo yabo tu zinyao. Yeah. Yabo, but you'll never as much as they do that, you'll never hear them comparing each other. Mm. to each yabo the complaining you know one has a particular function okay for the purpose the greater purpose you know what mm. i mean and that greater purpose for me can never be for it can never be a legit purpose if the purpose in itself is for the isolation of one form one body or part from the whole yabo this is when the divide and conquer politics for me kick in. Mm. Yeah, um, but you know, we know how to maneuver ourselves in these spaces. You know, you get me into that space, I'll talk that language. <laughs> you know, I'll yeah. talk it. Yeah, no, I'm I'm starting but to worry about mm. it, like like seriously. I'm starting to worry about it. And I don't want to pin it on anyone else. I mm. think it's something that I need to reflect on as yeah. well. I've written something actually on this question, um, and um, I've written it two, three years back. Actually, mm. I haven't shared it publicly. Mm. Um, so I have a position that I want to share um, at an appointed time, mm, mm, mm. and I think this year might be that time, because mm. um, I also feel I feel now um, that someone needs to speak for the boy child. Mm. Um, I, I feel someone, I have two uh, girls uh, for yes, children, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, I have a wife mm -hmm. uh, that I stay with, all three mm -hmm. of them, mm -hmm. um, so I'm like a minority in their presence, mm -hmm. um, so, but I have nephews, I have brothers, mm -hmm. you know, um, and I'm, I'm starting to see even young boys calling on my um, my inboxes and trying to reach out and mm -hmm. uh, to talk and to you know get mm -hmm. motivation or get this get support and mm -hmm. all of that. And I'm starting to feel like actually um, it will be great to to start reaching out publicly to towards that. No, you know towards that. Yeah. You've got a wife. You're a husband. You're a father. Two daughters, right? Particles, compartments, but at the end of the day, you are a family. A family, yes. Do you know what I mean? But now, in modern society, you are what you call this a girl dad. So we, now we've individualized you. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? And a lot of um, the debate, and this is what people sometimes miss out on, is the point of departure, you know? A lot of the debate will say, no, but African society is very masculine, blah, blah, blah. If you look at Ulwaluk, you know, that's, and then at the back of your head, you have to be like, but Ulwaluk has always had space for women. Mm. 
Yes, it is such a balance. What thing. you are yeah. departing from is the corruption that we are all lenders. And if you are telling me that your advancement is based on the, the corruption of me, then it's a wedding party for eternity. Mm. Right? Yeah. Until now you get into the fact that, but Ulaluko, Ulumsebenzi, was Siswe. Mm. Not a man's thing there. Mm. Yeah. So there's been a lot of bastardization of cultural institutions to to justify a further bastardization of Ubuntu holistically. Mm. Right. And uh, this is the issue for me. We are no longer uh, responding to the bigger picture. We are responding to cracks here and then, here and then, here and then. Do you know what I mean? So now, um, as a girl father, you must, this is what you must do. You know, but there's a bigger picture around you, mm. you know. They are the nephews, they are the this, yes. they are the this, the society I'm at large. I'm not just a girl father. I'm actually, you know, you, you, and, 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 and sorry, just to add on the question of, um, you know, the role of women in our society. Mm. Utabao, such a, a, a very powerful figure mm. um, in our culture, mm. and that we sing to, you know, and mm. petition Tabao mm. for mm. some power and strength mm. and mm. success. You know, um, there's, a, there's a queen, a queen Yese, you know, mm. um, who was quite strong in the pre in, 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 in number one, getting on to be king, mm. um, and, and then uh, I think he at the time was Unzambi, if I'm not mm. mistaken, mm. and um, and for Unlika to emerge, and um, you know, seeing the presence and the influence, yes, yes, um. Um, was here why mm, um, mm. but can hear a, a long run with, with that and then you see that Uluwalu Kosel Fuguti for this boy to come now um, to be a man actually a lot of women have to prepare a girl a, a clean girl has to prepare in the mm, mm. and all of that uh, also you know, carry the, the you know the ceremony mm -hmm. as much as there are roles for men mm -hmm. to also perform mm -hmm. at a particular time, mm -hmm. at a particular stage, mm -hmm. and all of that. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. That comes from both sides, but it, there's just order that mm -hmm. we can't dismiss. As mm -hmm. that you know, 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 Azum uh, Tambisa and mm. all of those things. There's a, there's order. There's mm. literal order mm. that we've 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 looked down upon mm. in our own culture and the significance mm. of that order in in creating a, a wholesome human being. Mm. Um, so the things you know that can be said that are not said. Uh, they are said. Uh, they are not balanced when they mm. said publicly to us. We discuss in emotions now. Mm. We discuss to make a point, not really mm. to be edified mm. as a society. And, and so just to add, yes. there are a lot of things that are said unconsciously. Mm. So if you are saying, that's why we are creating an Indawit app, then you are invalidating your own self within <laughs> the society. Yes. Yeah, well, and a lot of it happens because of ignorance, right? But you, you have deleted yourself. Um, so... Now I'm currently uh, busy with a body of knowledge, we are both. but sometimes we have to be human about how we access and distribute knowledge. You know, <laughs> have you ever had conversations with the modern woman as 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 and then but now these single ones now, you know, and then they talk why. And then you're like, This is our scenario. If this is let's let's put the value of the culture, the, mm. the, the cultural value systems. 
yeah, which are being shunned on yeah, to say, no, this culture is oppressive to women. Mm. You look at that, those value systems, <laughs> um, if you see Wolensi, you will understand that before you you know, but now we fun papa because that's it. who said it's the most important part. The important part is the beginning. And usually there's a tabao that instructs. That instructs. What needs to happen. You understand? Ah, so there's out, a lack know? of knowledge here. <laughs> you go there, you know, you do, and then you come and said, Uzo Yes. Jango bake benis two mil, gosho and 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 I those, those are the messengers mm -hmm. instructed up a guy yan pine country yeah but my cousin right and then our photos again we'll go let's say brand or in now in 2024 yeah well photos are key back on kumas right mm. that is a place that acts as the altar of this home where the ancestors of this home are fed, right? Mm. Then I take you as my wife and I sit you by the altar of my ancestors, right? Do mm. kiss by the altar of my ancestors so that you are welcomed by the ancestors of this home into this home. You, you tell me I'm oppressing you by sitting you at the altar of my ancestors. That is a point to make. <laughs> you understand? Yes, that's a very interesting and, and the important point, point to make. When ignorance. people have been ignorant yes. and the conditioning of this is what we know Utango to be. All of you and understand. Hinges. hinges. Yes. Now your mind is caught the into the, the hinges. <laughs> it's not. You're, you're caught in, <laughs> and not the symbolical and the cultural symbolism food of yeah. this particular place. Mm. You are caught in the Western architecture. Mm. And this is what we, we are all agree on this, is mm. that we have been bastardized. Yeah. But if you are going to criticize me on how I am bastardized, you will never find yourself if your point of departure is my bastardization. I'll conclude. Um, you've written Hope um, in a small city. In a small town. In a small town. Right? Yeah. Hope, small town. Yeah. That's small what hope, you... hope, small town. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what are you trying to say with this book? And I think um, I know that you have people but say pure skin. Yeah. Uh, at heart, when you actually wrote this book. No, this book. This book is a very uh, special book to me. So this is the book that earned me my masters, um, my creative writing masters. Oh. Great. Yeah. Uh, this was my academic project. Uh, you know, we must intersect. Yes. Yeah. Yes, then that's you, beautiful. you get so the you, you get the synergy, qualification, yeah, and yes. then you you get the product. You yeah. know. Um, but after three years of Uklala, a, a Pierstein, and working in Pierstein uh, farm town, um, that delay that year corner to to do a theatre. You know, community development through theatre. Um, I I was shoved into a very you know, compromise situation in terms of the socializing the community. But I met beautiful girls corner. Okay. Um who were denied the possibility of dreams, you know, because that's what agricultural towns do, you know. Um and boys, but you know, we are in the Namandom, you know, in this group. And uh, it was very, uh, it was a very beautiful experience to to begin to work with them and kind of resuscitate that I can dream, I can be more than you know a a cotton picker, a orange picker, you know, blah blah, all of that. Um, currently, a lot of those girls are in university, you know. Um, the last one, Uluvo, uh, who was the youngest when I was working in this group. Um, just passed a metric with a bachelor's, 
you know. That's good. Um, but my brother, for me, this book uh, holds a very sacred part of my life. You know, because I, writing it was again with my mentor, Nom uh, mm. you know, um, with that deliberate intent to humanize your people. Mm. Yeah, bo. Um, getting into their lives, you know, and being aware and deliberate of how you're extracting their stories. Because mm. it's, 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 it's a memoir. Mm. Yeah, bo. How you extract their stories and how you tell their stories and how you are on what you are intending towards. When you are intending, uh, when you are telling those stories, you know, yeah. Um, I have not really made up a lot about it, and uh, Ipala, and the intersection was the masters. I got the masters. Now the book is there. We are still um, exploiting the masters now, mm. um, but hopefully, um, we'll make a TV series out of this. Um, this call, this call of a lot of things, yeah. No, no, congratulations. I'm, I'm going to read it. Um, I have not had the opportunity to read. Uh, mm. Thank you for bringing that one. Mm. Um, I'm happy that, you know, when you, when you actually have um, something that you leave behind, you have a lot of those. You have a lot of, um, you know, markers of your life, mm. of your thinking um, mm. that you've left at, at different intervals. Mm. And it makes you um, a valuable contributor in our society. And... We wish for people to, to, to try and find ways to reach you, also to reach the material that you've written for us. There's an extensive archive that he's creating for, of his life, in Tolisa. And um, I'm happy that you, you came through. Do you want for two minutes or three minutes, now that you've had the conversation, mm -hmm. uh, if you want to have any concluding remarks, uh, you might have to come back again because I didn't cover everything that I wanted to cover. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, towards the end of the year, you have to also think of coming back or maybe halfway through the year so that you can have a further conversation around your writing and your take mm, mm, and mm. how you actually, um, you know, start writing your inspirations yeah. um, and, and, and your processes. We haven't, I haven't been able to get into those. Yeah. Um, uh, concluding remarks. Look, uh, the concluding remarks, let me rather not conclude. Mm and keep it open okay. uh, to come back. But uh, I'm looking for something I can rather read than to decide yeah, that off is, that, as a, that's great. As that's a great. goodbye. Um, great. Yeah, I think I found something. This one is from a chapter called Holidays. Um, I'll keep it short. Um, holidays basically being, it being holidays and how we experience it differently as people. Uh, let me just go back. And... Hey, it's a long problem. Okay, let me start here. Expectations, expectations, expectations. Sometimes they go against one's dreams, especially in a world where the bigger the city, the better the possibilities to fulfill the dream. Pearson, by its size, is definitely not the platform I should be standing on to reach my dreams. I would rather be climbing a broken ladder to the fifth floor. But Elizabeth, this was before Kabir, is a better ladder fresh from the box and fitted with extra support. Johannesburg, on the other hand, could be an elevator that at the touch of a button would lift me inside a mechanical box straight to the top. Yet, here I am in Pearson, an old ladder left out in the rain for many cold nights with wood rotting and steps that snap under the foot at the slightest step. The problem here is there are too many souls and young people with dreams the size of planets climbing, climbing up this ladder, up and down, footing and stepping with precision, avoiding the cracked steps 
that would snap and, sna and send them down the gaping throat of poverty and brokenness. A crew of beautiful young girls, not needing, but wanting a lifeline, a rope to improvise their ascent from the marginalized skirts to the dignified edge in case the, sled, the ladder snap underneath them. Pearson is not a town in a country, but a flea on a madras, a disease-infested parasite making a meal of its sleepy host, the hopes and dreams of youth. Thank you so much. Thank you for coming, ladies and gentlemen. I have had this honor to sit and listen to this wisdom, uh, this kindness, and this thought that has gone to our people. And uh, I hope you enjoy his work. You can search for his work also online, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Look, I, I've, 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 I've moved myself from social media a bit, yeah. but the, gym, uh, the email is always a good point. Tolisa.ngubelanga at gmail.com. Yes. You know, yeah. Thank you so much and uh, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you very much, guys.